This is Ghana Tonight here on your election command center. And the vice president and losing candidate in the U.S. elections, Kamala Harris, has just delivered a concession speech following Donald Trump's election as the next president of the United States of America. Let's take a listen to Kamala Harris just a while ago. It's full today. My heart is full today, full of gratitude for the trust you have placed in me, full of love for our country, and full of resolve. The outcome of this election is not what we wanted, not what we fought for, not what we voted for, but hear me when I say, hear me when I say, the light of America's promise will always burn bright. As long as we never give up and as long as we keep fighting. Now I know folks are feeling and experiencing a range of emotions right now. I get it. <laughs> but we must. Well, so Kamala Harris has since called President-elect Donald Trump the 45th and 47th President of the United States of America. And rightly so, this is how he announced his victory last night. This was a movement like nobody's ever seen before. Frankly, this was, I believe, the greatest political movement of all time. There's never been anything like this in this country and maybe beyond. And now it's going to reach a new level of importance because we're going to help our country heal. We're going to help our country heal. We have a country that needs help and it needs help very badly. We're going to fix our borders. We're going to fix everything about our country. We made history for a reason tonight, and the reason is going to be just that. We overcame obstacles that nobody thought possible, and it is now clear that we've achieved the most incredible political thing. Look what happened. Is this crazy? And Donald Trump there basking in all the glory and the victory uh, there. He also won the Electoral College, won the popular votes. The Republicans control the House of Representatives. They control the Senate as well. There's a lot that's going on right for the Republicans in the United States. Both the MPP and the NDC have con they've all sent messages and statements congratulating Donald Trump and the Republicans. And a very interesting wording. But this is your election command center.